Hi, it's Nora from Printful. Today, let's go through the steps of connecting your Weebly store with Printful. We'll look at how to connect a new Weebly account to Printful, how to add products to your Weebly website, and how to set up shipping for your Printful products on Weebly. So, let's start connecting Weebly and Printful. To begin, you'll need accounts on both platforms. So if you're not a Printful customer yet, go ahead and create your free account on our homepage. If you don't have a Weebly account set up, you'll need to create and publish a new Weebly store. To do that, head over to Weebly and sign up. Or you can go to our Weebly Connect page for easy access. You'll find a link to it in the description below. Note that you can connect to Printful and publish products if you're using the free Weebly plan, but the products you publish will be inactive, meaning customers can't buy them. To activate your products for purchase, you'll need to choose one of Weebly's paid subscription plans. We'll come back to that later on in the video. So here you can sign up for a Weebly account. After adding in all your details, here you need to choose Create a Website. It's important you choose this option here, otherwise you won't be able to connect your Weebly account to Printful later on. Now you'll have to set up your Weebly store. So first, choose a theme. I'll go with this one for this tutorial and hit Start Editing here. Now you can set up your store's domain. This is what I'd like to call my website. And I'll go ahead and choose the free Weebly subdomain option here. And now you can start editing your website. One very important step you need to do when creating your website layout is to add a product block in your store's shop section if it's not there already. This is to make sure the products you'll add later on through Printful show up on your storefront. You can find it here and just drag and drop it in your shop section. You'll be able to edit all of this later on as well. If you have any questions on how to edit your Weebly website, reach out to Weebly's support team and look at the resources they provide. For this example, I won't go into all the details on designing a Weebly website, and I'll leave the basic layout we have here. Note that you need to have a website published to connect it with Printful. So once you're done with your store setup, hit Publish. To integrate with Printful, go to the Weebly App Center and search for Printful. Now go through the connecting steps and all done. Your Weebly account is connected to Printful. Next up, you'll want to add products to your Weebly store. Here, we have to look at Weebly's subscription plans. As I mentioned before, you can connect and add products from Printful to your Weebly store with a free plan, but to make your product active for purchase, you have to choose one of the paid plans for online stores. For starting out, the free plan is a great way to go through the process of adding your products, and once you decide to make them available to buy, you can upgrade your Weebly plan and activate your products. Depending on which plan you choose, there might be limitations on how many products you can sell. Each variant is a separate product on Weebly, so, for example, if you're adding a t-shirt in multiple colors and sizes, each color and size combination will count as a new product. So remember that when deciding on your Weebly plan. So let's go through the process of adding a product directly from Printful to your Weebly store. To do that, in your Printful dashboard, hit Add Product. Now, let's say I want to add a t-shirt. I'll choose the model of the shirt, the colors, the sizes I'd like to add. Remember that if you're publishing your products right away, Weebly considers each size and color combination as a separate product. Now let's add our design. You can either upload your own print file, or here choose one of our free sample designs created by our in-house graphic design team. You can also create a print file right here in our generator by using the text and clipart tools. We have a helpful video that goes into more detail on how to create a t-shirt design with our generator. So watch it when you're done with this tutorial. I'll leave a link to it in the description below. For this video, I'll choose a sample design. Next, choose the mock-up images you want to display as product photos on your store. Now you can add in the product details. As you can see, we already have the basic product info provided here. We recommend personalizing your product descriptions, but for this video, I'll leave it as is. Here you can edit the retail price by setting how much profit you want. For example, we see Printful's fulfillment price for this t-shirt in this column. Let's say we want our profit to be a little bit more for each shirt, so we set it here and the retail price is automatically adjusted. Make sure you check this box for your products to sync over to Weebly. And you can also add your product to a category if you've already created them on your Weebly store. Once you're done setting up all the product info, submit it to your store. Wait for it to sync, and here it is. 
Now the next step, you have to add the product you just created to your shop section on Weebly. Products you create with Printful are automatically synced with your Weebly account, but they have to be added to your website layout manually. This is a step you have to do for each product you add through Printful. Otherwise, they won't be visible on your Weebly website. So, head over to your Weebly dashboard and open the website editor. Go to your shop section or wherever you added the product block. Click on it and here you'll see the product we just created in Printful. Let's select it. Choose the display layout. And done. Now your product is added to your website layout. Let's hit publish again. And if we open the website, under the shop section, here's the product. But since we created and added it with Weebly's free plan, if you open it, it's inactive for your customers to buy. To activate your products, you'll need to upgrade to one of Weebly's paid plans, as I mentioned before. Let's take a look at setting up shipping for your Printful products on Weebly. In your Weebly dashboard, go to Store, and choose Shipping here. Here, add in your store name. In the store address field, you have to add Printful's Charlotte Westlake Drive location address. You can find the full address on our contacts page or pause the video and write it down. I'll also uncheck the box that says it's our store's main address since this will only be for our shipping address. Now here, you can add shipping regions and rates depending on where you're planning to sell. For this example, let's say my shipping region will be the US. It was automatically set here for me as a region, so I just have to add the rates for it. To set up shipping rates for your Printful products, you'll have to choose the order weight option here. So let's pick that and we'll name the shipping rate. We recommend calling it flat rate. And now you can add in shipping rates based on the estimated weight ranges of your products. You can find Printful's shipping rates for all our products on our shipping page. I'll link to it in the description below. And depending on the products you're planning to sell, you can set the shipping weight categories and their corresponding rates. Lastly, a very important step before you start selling, don't forget to set up your billing information on Printful in order for your purchases to go through. You can find your billing settings in your Printful dashboard with helpful guides on how to set up. Make sure you go through all our resources on how to set up Weebly with Printful. I'll leave a link to our FAQ in the description below. And if you have any questions on how to set up your Weebly website, check out Weebly's helpful guides on building your site. Thanks for watching, and if you're new to our channel, be sure to subscribe. Our videos will help you create better designs for your products, learn more about building an e-commerce business, and marketing your brand.